the Creatrix Gallery Podcast. Hello everyone, Happy New Year! Is it still acceptable to say that on December 3rd? Ugh, I don't know. (laughs) It probably isn't. Anyway, welcome to 2022. This really is going to be the best year yet. Things on the Creatrix Gallery podcast are going to be a lot different in 2022. For a start, there is going to be two episodes released each day. This episode that you're listening to now is the daily gratitude practice, helping you start your day off in the best way possible. Before we get into the episode, let's begin like we always do, by taking a few deep breaths, breathing in through the nose, and out through the mouth. Breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. Last time, breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. There we go, three calming breaths. I always feel so brilliantly lifted after doing that. Isn't it amazing what a few deep breaths can do? Anyway, back to our daily gratitude practice. Each morning at 6am GMT, the new gratitude episode of the Creatrix Gallery podcast is going to be released. The morning episodes follow on from something we did throughout the whole of December, which you all seemed to really enjoy and that is focusing on gratitude. Taking the time each day to focus on things that we're grateful for has a multitude of benefits. The biggest of them being that when you look at all of the things that you have in your life that you're grateful for, it just makes you feel so incredibly good about your life and yourself. Another benefit is that when we focus on the things that we're grateful for, they multiply And we attract more of those things and more positive things in general into our lives. But I think most importantly, it helps us all to stay grounded, to stay connected and to just realise how truly blessed we all are. In December, we counted one additional thing to be grateful for each day, starting with one and ending with 31. But throughout the year, As we give thanks each and every day, we're going to do it differently. This year, I really, really want to focus on the master number we've been blessed with and focus on the number 22. Known in numerology as the master builder, the number 22 channels cosmic wisdom down to earth and uses it to turn incredible dreams into reality. I'm sure I speak for all of us when I say this is something we all want to achieve. Now, not many of us have the time in the morning to sit and write 22 things that we're grateful for. I'm not even sure I have the time for that and I'm the one who came up with the idea. So we're not going to do that, but what we are going to do is this. In the morning episode of the podcast, you're going to write down 11 things that you're grateful for. And as part of the evening podcast, you'll write down 11 positive things or wins from your day. So that in total, over the course of the day, you've celebrated 22 positives in your life. I'll play a beautiful piece of music composed especially for the Creatrix Gallery by Richard Digens for you to listen to whilst you write your daily gratitude list. And then, once the music is finished, we're going to say some powerful I am affirmations to really start your day off right. And then to end, I'm going to play another piece of instrumental music for you to listen to 
whilst you plan your day, meditate, do some yoga, drink your coffee, the choice is entirely yours. So, are you ready? Before you start writing down your gratitude, let's take a few deep breaths together. Breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. Breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. One last time, breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. Now, here is a beautiful piece of instrumental music for you to listen to whilst you write down 11 things you are grateful for.
As you finish your gratitude list, let's end with a few deep breaths. Breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. In through the nose. And out through the mouth. One last time. Breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. And so it is. How did you find that? Did you find it easy to think of 11 things to be grateful for? Or did you struggle? No matter how you felt, please know that it's perfectly normal. And I can guarantee that you are not alone. It can be overwhelming trying to think of things to be grateful for. You might be worried about what others think about your list. And perhaps you were focusing on what you feel you should be grateful for rather than what you actually are grateful for? Please know that your gratitude is completely unique for you and you are allowed to be grateful for whatever you want. This is about your feelings and emotions. Now we are going to say 22 powerful I am affirmations to raise our vibrations even more and to set you up for the day ahead. Repeat them with me. I am grateful for another amazing day. I am grateful for another amazing day. I am grateful for my incredible life. I am grateful for my incredible life. I am healthy. I am healthy. I am wealthy. I am wealthy. I am whole. I am whole. I am strong. I am strong. I am full of love. I am full of love. I am blessed. I am blessed. I am powerful. I am powerful. I am happy. I am happy. I am successful. I am successful. I am peaceful. I am peaceful. I am safe. I am safe. I am on the right path. I am excited for what's to come. I am on the right path. I am excited for what's to come. I am achieving all of my wildest dreams. 
I am achieving all of my wildest dreams. I am making a positive difference in this world. I am making a positive difference in this world. I am grateful for all of the love in my life. I am grateful for all of the love in my life. I am grateful for all of the abundance in my life. I am grateful for all of the abundance in my life. I am grateful for all of the wonderful things that will happen to me today. I am grateful for all of the wonderful things that will happen to me today. I am open and ready to receive miracles. I am open and ready to receive miracles. I am a powerful manifester. I am a powerful manifester. I am a powerful manifester. And so it is. Let's lock in those affirmations with some more deep breaths. Breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. Breathing in through the nose. and out through the mouth. One last time, breathing in through the nose. And out through the mouth. Thank you for joining me for this morning gratitude episode of the Creatrix Gallery podcast. I am incredibly grateful that you have chosen to spend this time with me. And I look forward to seeing you again either later on today for the evening episode of the Creatrix Gallery podcast or perhaps tomorrow morning. Hopefully both because I just love having you here. You're so special to me. I'm now going to play some more beautiful instrumental music for you to listen to whilst you plan your day, meditate, do some yoga, drink your tea, or whatever else you choose to do really. As for me, I am going to take my coffee and the beautiful music I'm about to play and I'm going to do some meditation and then I'm going to come back inside and I'm going to do some work on my new project, well, my new old project, The Yellow Cafe, because I'm so, so excited that it is launched again. If you didn't hear the episode yesterday in which I talked about The Yellow Cafe, then let me tell you a little about it. The Yellow Cafe is built on creativity and originality to stir your imagination. Inspired by artist Vincent van Gogh, the name is a combination of two of his paintings, Yellow House where he lived for many years and the cafe where he talked all things creative with his bohemian friends and fellow artists long into the night. The Yellow Cafe, just like the internet itself, is open 24-7, open to visitors at all times. Please don't confuse yourself with the internet cafe craze of years ago, as this is something completely different. When Vincent died in 1890, aged 37, he left far more than just his 871 paintings behind. He left a way of life, an attitude, an atmosphere, all of which is embodied by the Yellow Cafe. There's a link in the description if you'd like to find out more. 
Thank you once again for joining me today. I really do wish you the very best for 2022, and I look forward to spending time with you each and every day. I'd also like to take this moment to say a special thank you to Richard Digence for all of the amazing music you hear throughout this episode and all of the episodes of the Creatrix Gallery podcast. In fact, here's a piece now. Take care.
Thank you for listening to the Creatrix Gallery podcast.